Google have just released Firebase Studio, which is like a competitor to Bolt and Lovable. It's a full stack AI workspace for building apps. I'll show you some stuff that I've created and I'll show you how to get access to this today. It is completely free. All right. So you don't need to pay for this. It can leverage Gemini 2.5 Flash as well. And you can see how it works. If you ever use Project IDX from Google previously, this has been rebranded now to Firebase Studio. And you can see you can basically no code it. So you can just go in, you prototype an app, you can build mobile apps or whatever. You can use all these different types of apps as well. And it is completely free to access. So really powerful stuff. And I'm going to show you how to access this today. Now, this has just been released a few hours ago. So if you actually go to try Firebase Studio, you're going to find out Oh, it's actually working now. Wow. Okay. Before it actually said too busy to it. I was going to show you a workaround, but that's okay. So you can see a bunch of like different sample prompts we can create right here. Let's say we want to create a expense calculator. We can prototype the AI app with AI right here. And it's completely free inside Firebase Studio. Now, if you want to get access to this, just go to studio.firebase.google.com. Boom shakalak. All you need is a free Gmail account. And then you can type in your prompt over here and no code that bad boy, right? Prototype it out like you can see, and then it's going to start working. It's magic. So let's wait for that to load. I couldn't get into it before, so I had to create something new on a separate sort of workflow. As you can see right here, we created this test SEO tool where you can pop in your tool, add the word count. It gives you the keyword density, etc., for the keyword that you want to rank for. And you can create this completely free for no code with Gemini. But this seems to be working even better. So you can see here, for example, we said, okay, here's a plan for how we'll prototype this app. Take a cheeky look below and customize as needed. Or if you're ready, select prototype this app. The app blueprint is budget wise. Here's the features, right? I haven't typed any of this in, by the way. It just came up with this and did its magic, as you can see right here. And then we've got a nice little color. So we can actually choose between the different colors that we want. We've got the layout, the iconography and the animation, all right? So like subtle transitions and animations to provide visual feedback to the user. We'll click prototype this app and it's just going to go off and do its magic. Now, the beautiful thing about this is number one, you can create apps. Number two is very easy to use. Number three is completely free. And number four, you can actually publish these and host them on a subdomain, all right? So once you're ready to go with these, for example, like that tool that I created earlier, then we can go onto here. We can open this up in a pop-up. If we click on open, that is deployed on a nice little subdomain right there as well. It's really easy to create these apps. Super powerful. It's ridiculous that you can just create an app in one single prompt like you can see right here. And then we're off to the races, right? Now you may see some issues because this is coding and that sort of thing. So you can like just ask it inside here to fix stuff. And also if it seems that you need a Gemini key, all you can do Let's have a look. So it might auto generate right there, but if you can't get one or if you need to go and grab one, you can go to aistudio.google.com over here, click get API key. And they've also done a nice little revamp of AI Studio as well. It used to be a lot clunkier than this. Go to get API key and you can create a free one like you can see right here and then plug that in as well. So if it ever does ask you for an API key or that sort of thing, it's quite easy to just generate one directly over inside AI Studio. But yeah, that's how you can build stuff, all right? And there we go, look at that. Living the dream, my friend. Pretty simple and easy. If you've got any issues, like you can see right here, so you can see there's a little console error. We can click on fix error and it should just automatically troubleshoot that bad boy for us. We'll wait for that to load. And hopefully that looks like it's fixed right there, okay? And then again, you can go on to a subdomain if you want to deploy it. You can click on publish over here. So let's click on publish. And then you can go off and set up the environment like you can see. All right? Pretty simple. Let's try and create some more now. Now, if you want to get all my best prompts, etc., you can get that inside the AI Profit Boardroom community right here. We also we're constantly posting like new examples. There's actually a bunch of Manus invitation codes as well that someone has posted inside the group. Thanks to legendary Jovan. Thank you, sir, for posting those. And uh, you can see there's all sorts of stuff being posted here. Like it's a very active community. So if you want to join 691 people focused on making more money and saving time of AI, feel free to join the AI Profit Boardroom. 
And if we go to the SAP section over here, I've actually added a new section for Firebase Studio with a hundred different prompts that you can use for creating whatever you want, all right, with apps. So if you wanted to come up with some ideas, there's a bunch of ideas inside the AI Profit Boardroom. Let's come up with a new idea. Let's say, for example, we want to create a SEO app for learning SEO link building, but for SEO, right? Anki is like a flashcard app. So we'll just put Anki flashcards, but for SEO. So we'll plug that in. You can also attach images here. So if you have an idea of what you want to insert there, you can insert it over here, but we're going to go with prototype with AI just for keeping it simple and easy. Like you can see, you could also ask chat GPT to modify the prompt for you to improve it. And we will keep going through. So you can see it comes up with the ideas. If you want to change something, then you can say, okay, make the app name more interesting. Plus use my brand colors and we'll set our brand colors over here. And then it will just come up with a new idea and it's using the colors that we have as well now, All right? Like you can see, so it's using our brand colors, like you can see, and it's also changed the app name based on our request. And then once we're ready to go, we can click on prototype this app. That's going to start working as magic. You don't need to be able to code at all to be able to use this. And it's just it's no coding. So whilst I'm talking to you, it's just building the app casually as you do. And bear in mind back in the day, like you pay thousands of dollars for a SaaS developer and have to wait around for weeks and weeks for this to come back to you. Now you can just create this coded app. You're ready to go. It'll go off, do its magic. And you can just go off, make a cup of tea and then come back when you're ready, right? I think you could probably also create websites as well using Firebase, but for now it seems to be like fully focused on creating the apps. Now also what you can do is you can switch to code over here. And if there's anything you want to change, you can just describe the changes you want to make over here. I also think it'd be interesting to try and make games with this, but we've got the flashcard app right here. So what is a backlink? And also you can see there's always, there seems to be a couple of issues each time you code out. So just bear in mind there. And also it seems like we need an API key from Gemini. So I'm going to grab an API key. We'll delete this one in a second, but we'll grab it for now. Plug it in here, hit continue, fix the errors. And then we can start building out these apps. All right. So just to recap, let's see if that's working. Got another issue there. Now, also the cool thing here is like all your workspaces are safe. So if we go back to studio.firebase.google.com, you can see all the previous workspaces that we've got. So for example, the link leap SEO flashcard app is ready to go right there. Budget wise is ready to go as well. We can share it, delete it, rename it or reset it as well. For example, if I wanted to share this tool with people on my team, I can just type in their email address or copy the link and share that with them as well. We can also generate a QR code that people can scan to access it. And let's open this up, make sure it's working. Here we go. And there we go. Right now, if we wanted to change this, so it's okay, just make it so that I can review the flashcards and learn from them. Also, nothing happens when I click to reveal answer, make the UI simpler and easier to use. That's interesting as well. It's got like a drawing feature here. So look at that. You can actually draw. If we click cancel, we can go back and we'll just ask it to improve the UI. Doesn't seem to be any limits on this as well. I'm sure you do hit a limit eventually, but it's pretty crazy that you can just keep building and building without hitting any limits and also build like multiple apps at the same time as well. But yeah, I bet, you know, if you spent a morning just coding out here, you could create something really good and it's quite simple and easy. Also, the other thing here is on the chat, you can actually restore the previous version. So if you want to go back to this one, for example, just click restore. And these are like little checkpoints where you can go back to previous versions of your app. And also look at this, you got, so you got a new flashcard section. You got your Anki decks over here, your AI learning tool, and then there's some settings here. So you can change like the profile and settings, etc. And then if you see any issues like this, just click on pop up, click on fix error and boom, off to the race. It's all right. So thanks so much for watching. If you want to get access to hundred prompts on how to use Firebase, then feel free to get that inside the AI profit border. 
If you just go inside this community link in the comments description, this is focused on making more money and saving time with AI. If you just type in Firebase in the chat over here, you'll see all these different sections, including the Firebase Studio section that has a hundred prompts on different apps and tools you can build. And also feel free to post anything that you create and share it inside the community because we've, all, we've got an awesome bunch of people here, all interested in like lovable, bold, different app building tools. And you can just share whatever you create inside the community. Also, this comes with weekly Q and A calls. So you can jump on the weekly Q and ask any questions you have and get help. If you ever get stuck, you can jump on the Q and A calls, get live help. These get recorded as well, so you can watch them back. And if you need your questions answered in between the Q and A's, just post it inside the community here. And this also comes with all my best workflows, tips, templates, tutorials, like all of these are separate courses. The amount of stuff in here is absolutely wild, right? Like just in the AI agents and workflow section, you can see all these different sections on different ways to create AI agents. And we have tons of SAPs down here as well. Thanks so much for watching. And additionally, if you want to get a free one-to-one -one SEO strategy session that shows you how we went from zero to 145,000 business month and generate hundreds of thousands of dollars in sales on autopilot, feel free to get that on this free link burning acceleration session, you'll get a tailored game plan to get you more leads, traffic, and sales to your website for free. We'll answer any questions you have one-to-one -one on the call, and you'll learn the best link strategy for your website based on what's working for our happy clients, like you can see right here. So if you want to get more leads, traffic, sales, if you want to get free customers from Google, if you want to outrank your competitors, feel free to book in a free SEO strategy session. Link in the comments and the description.